Noor Salman, the widow of the Orlando nightclub shooter, is currently on trial on federal terrorism charges for her alleged role in the massacre. 49 people were killed when Omar Mateen opened fire in June of 2016. Yesterday, prosecutors showed the jury surveillance video of the shooting as they laid out a timeline. Today, as they try to prove their case, that video was made public. We caution you, it is graphic. Here's Michelle Miller. Government attorneys said they showed this video to jurors because they believe it is the clearest evidence they have pointing to Noor Salman as providing material support of aiding and abetting her husband in committing a terrorist attack. The edited courtroom video begins by showing Omar Mateen buying a ticket before walking into Pulse as clubgoers are enjoying Last Call. It's just before 2 a.m. Mateen then leaves the building, but returns less than 10 minutes later and almost immediately opens fire into the main part of the club with his semi-automatic rifle. After appearing to fire off several shots, he walks toward the back of the club, firing again, methodically picking off patrons. He appears to shoot some victims once they are already down. At one point, Mateen drops a used clip and reloads. Stalking back and forth between rooms, he continues to fire away and then heads toward the restroom where people can be seen on cell phone video huddled in fear. At 2.07, roughly six minutes after he started shooting, police entered the building with guns drawn. As they search inside for Mateen, they are seen stepping over victims. Yes, get outside, get outside and evacuating as many who are still alive as possible. If you can move, you need to leave. By 2.37, survivors can be seen climbing out of the building as law enforcement continues to enter the club. That video shows the police engaging Mateen, but it does not show his final moments. He was found dead more than three hours after the gunfire began. Jeff, the attorney for Mateen's widow, in her defense, Mateen decided to go to the club at the last minute, and therefore she had no idea of her husband's, her husband's intentions on committing that crime. All right, Michelle Miller tonight, thank you.